Got him. Oh, it's a good fish. Fish one. Oh, it's a good one too. What is up everybody, Fish Hawk here. Hope you guys are having a great day. If you're new here, consider subscribing. I put out new videos every single week. In this video, I'm fishing a creek I've never fished before. It is absolutely gorgeous. Crystal clear water, ice cold. I'm chasing native brook trout and wild brown trout. It's a beautiful day, getting up to about 50 degrees. The sun's out, blue skies. Hopefully I can get some fish in the net. Stay tuned. Let me show you guys my setup for today. Six foot ultralight St. Croix Premier Rod. Fluger President Reel, and I got four pound test P-Line fluorocarbon. Down on this end, I have a white rooster tail spinner, 1 16th of an ounce, single hook, and about 10 inches above that, I have a barrel swivel to keep line twist out of my line. Holy moly, I got one. Look at that. And it is a native brookie. First fish of the day, guys. Seven inch native brookie. Absolutely gorgeous. First trout of the day. Little native brookie from under this bridge. Let's see if there's another one under there. All right, keep working our way upstream. I figured there'd be more than one under this bridge. Fish on. And it's a little brownie. Second fish of the day, another seven inch trout, but this time it's a brownie. I'm not expecting to catch any giants today. That's why I have my ultralight out with four pound test line. The native brookies and the wild brownies in this creek don't get very big, but man, are they pretty. It's not always about the size of the fish. I love getting out here, fishing these little mountain creeks and catching beautiful trout regardless of their size. Just something about it. That bright sun could make fishing difficult today. Normally when you're fishing clear water like this, you wanna fish on cloudy days. That way the fish can't see you as well and see your lure as well. Fish on. Let's go. Best fish of the day so far, almost 10 inch wild brownie. You guys see that right there? That's what I like to see. No footprints. Making a switch, same exact spinner, except this one's black. I'm covering a ton of water today. I'm only hitting spots that look juicy. I'm making two or three casts in the juicy holes. And if I don't get a hit, I'm moving on. From my experience, when you're fishing for native or wild trout, once you cast in there a couple times, if they don't hit it, they're not going to hit it. So I don't even waste my time standing at a hole for five, 10 minutes, make a couple casts and keep moving. Fish one. Oh, good fish. Oh, good fish. Let's go. Absolutely gorgeous. Wild brown, right around 12 inches. Now that was a trophy trout for this creek, guys. He was hanging in that undercut bank right there. Looks like I better be paying attention to undercut banks today. Maybe that's where a lot of them are hanging out.
Fish one. Oh, it's a good one too. Oh, it's a rainbow. Holy crap, guys. Never expected to catch a rainbow. Just caught the biggest fish of the day. Gorgeous rainbow trout around 13 inches. I just realized something, guys. I completed the trifecta. I caught a brookie, a brownie, and a rainbow. It's pretty cool. This dam created a long, slow hole. I did see some fish hitting the top up here. Hopefully I can get one in the net. Got him. Oh, it's a good fish. Oh, let's go. It's a brownie. Just caught a 13 inch wild brown. Absolutely gorgeous. Look at the colors. Fish one. Oh, it's a rainbow. Just caught about a 13 inch rainbow. All right, guys, I broke off my black rooster tail, going back to white. Let's see if I can get a few more fish in the net before I call it a day. Fish on. Let's go. Wild brownie. Gorgeous wild brownie around 10 inches. All right, guys, that is going to do it for today. I'm heading back to the truck. Had an amazing day of trout fishing. First time ever fishing this creek. Ended up completing the trifecta. Caught a brook trout, some brown trout, and some rainbow trout, all in a rooster tail spinner. I used white and black, 1 16th of an ounce. All the information for the gear I used will be down in the description. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoyed this video, make sure you hit the subscribe button and also give me a thumbs up. It'll really help me out. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. As always, thank you so much for watching. Fish Hulk out.